Hello, boys and girls, my name is Halsey Steen. Welcome back to another episode of Oxygen Not Included. Last time it was a bit of a mixed bag. Um, we tackled uh, various things, uh, but I think one of the main things we want to focus on next is getting this iron volcano set up and this might take a while uh, while I have everything planned out uh, down here uh, we need two steam turbines up on top and for that we need a bit more steel so uh, we turn on our uh, steel production uh, metal refinery up here once again and we should be good uh, when it comes to uh, to cooling uh, in part we are already uh, in the in the negative temperatures um, so that's looking good we also there are some pieces of uh, a pipe that we want to switch out with radiant pipe for a better cooling purpose and then we can start this cooling loop up here which should bring temperatures up here down enough so the mealwood can grow again and hopefully also over on here we can then cool it down enough so we can actually make use of uh, these two additional farms but that probably will take a bit of time and due to the the dyed millwood all our uh, draglets died as well um, but there are still a few on the map that we can uh, catch and put into our base so that's not really a problem So, planning for the wiring goes like this, we will have another um, a switch plate over here and then we basically can do this or mm, maybe we shall do this not with uh, with iron but with copper amalgam which can take a bit more heat and then we will see how far we go here our air conditioning uh, is working out quite nicely if we have a look we're going in with a bit above 60 degrees we're coming out uh, at under 20 degrees that's that's cool enough so we are getting into uh, the uh, the green area again away from the uh, reddish colors then right here these slicksters we can turn them um, into our next meal You can create a slickster farm uh, down in your uh, 
in your biome where there is a lot of carbon dioxide and they will produce oil but it's not a huge amount so usually it's just easier to uh, use the uh, oil reservoirs for that all you need is a bit of water and a bit of uh, power so let's see what we have here yes we sword We do not have enough uh, uh, seating rooms uh, for all our duplicants. So let's create a dedicated room up here. Not as big as the uh, other one, but also a, a large, large mess hall, because that gives uh, more morale bonus. Eventually, we probably will want to do something with the carbon dioxide that collects up here down in the low portion. But as long as the big part of our base is covered uh, in oxygen, I'm not really uh, worried about that. Right, uh, we do have a bit more um, more steel, so that means we can at least plan out the first one, which goes on here, and the second goes there. So that means you can dig out this space here as well. Eventually, we'll have to uh, vacuum the uh, area in here uh, out. Uh, in order to provide optimal cooling. And get in a bit of hydrogen in the in the top part or we could do with with setup like like here I'm wondering why there is ice on the, on the floor here. The steam turbine is really cold. Uh, 
minus temperatures. Yeah, looks like this cooling setup works quite, quite well. However, I would imagine that uh, down here we will have something similar to this one where we cool down uh, with the water we get out of, of this one. So question then becomes where do we get the uh, the hydrogen from? We could take it from here. I think this bridge is no longer needed. Um, probably need a bridge over to this side then maybe put in a vent here this and then to fill this room we would probably it from here somewhere should also help with uh, reaching uh, this area and then of course we need to uh, pull down this uh, this heavy watt wire here have enough steel for the second turbine we can put that one in Ooh, um wait 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 That one is constructed out of lead. That's no good. Gets no good at all. We need to create it out of steel. 
And if we do that, we do not have enough for two of those. In here, I think we can use uh, lead pipes. They are not that nice to look at, but our duplicates will not be in here. Uh, and then the liquid went, we will have right here. Um, made out of gold amalgam, yes. An isolated pipe going all the way to over here. And we can also dig all this out. What do we get? Poke shell spawn. Yes. And we will stick you in with the uh, rest of your company. And let's continue the piping. Here we need a bridge, of course. Then we should be good to go and we can deconstruct this bit and connect here. Um, but let's wait with this last piece here so that we actually have to pump out this area first. That goes to here. Uh, then, of course, we need the, the power. Comes in from this side. And going all the way to here. We need to have the floor here so it can work. Need a bit more steel to plan the, the second steam turbine, but then 
basically everything is planned and it's only a matter of doing. But I think that will do for this episode and hopefully we can see some real progress uh, down here in the next one. Hope you enjoyed this and turn in for the next one. See you then. Goodbye.